Hey guys, I'm back. I know I've been uh, behind on the sailboat runs because that last storm damaged the boat. If you haven't seen it, I'll put the card up here. And uh, the Aka, the crossbeam here, I got it fixed. I took it to a I took it to a Midas shop. They put it on the ground and lowered their hoists, their car hoists, on top of it to straighten it out. And I ended up having to get a bigger hoist on it with an employee with a customer's car on it and drop up and down, up and down until they got the thing to straighten out just right. It went right in perfect. It's rocking and rolling. Yes, you're all enough. Uh, right on cue comes the chainsaws. And uh, got my sails back from the sail makers yesterday. Haven't had them out of the bag, but I hear it's all good. So that's where the boat's at. Just wanted to get you an update. But right now, I'm getting ready to leave Houston and head for Myrtle Beach. Got the car all packed up, do some bicycling out there, Merrill's Inlet or whatnot. Looks pretty cool. Find some interesting stuff. Some family and friends, some drinking and carousing, and uh, go get in trouble. But I just wanted to uh, give you guys an update where we're at on the boat. When I get back in a week from Myrtle Beach, then uh, I got an idea for the boat run. Be a good one. I'll see you there. Fast forward three days, Myrtle Beach. Two day drive in, got in about dinner time last night. I hit the hotel on the way down here. And Greenville, Alabama, I think it was. Got up the next morning, taking the bicycle from the hotel room to the car. Took it for a ride around the uh, hotel parking lot a little bit, stretch my legs, everything's good. Put it on the rack, tie it down. <clears throat> a few hours later, I get out, check if I'm doing a pee break. Rear tire's flat. Look at it closer. It's literally blown out. There's a hole blown out of the tire. It was just fine when I put it on, tied it down. Somewhere in the drive, it blew. So uh, down here, brought it all the way out here to go for rides. Got a blown tire. Now, no one has that size tire. It's like a weak order. So I got a tire a little bigger. A cheapy ass tire. We're going to throw it on there. See if it'll get me through the weekend. It's a 26 by 1.5, 100 PSI tire. We're going into a 26 one and three quarters. I think it's about a 50 PS tire, PSA, PSI. And uh, I don't know if it'll work or not, but for 20 bucks, if I, I'd be bummed if I brought this bike all the way out here and can't ride it. So uh, we're gonna put it together, see what happens, see if we get a beach ride in. You can see in the old tire, that sucker, it was just split wide open. Look at this thing. It just opened right up. So, uh, true excitement. Blew that thing right open. We got it now though, so we're rocking. All right, the verdict is it worked great. A little too, a little too wide, a little 65 pound instead of the 100 pound. It's just a, a generic little, uh, Get the kids around town tire, but it'll get me through for the weekend. It actually works really good, so the weekend is rocking, we're bicycling. All right, so the test is success. The tire rocked, did a little loop there, went down to the beach and back. Hopefully we'll get down to Merrill's Inlet. I'm probably saying that wrong. 
get a ride in down there maybe tomorrow and uh, see if we find something else Monday. I might get some video up, may not. Just want to give an update on uh, the status of the sailboat. It's been repaired, sails are back, everything's rocking. So as soon as I get back to Houston, here from uh, Myrtle Beach, in a week, start organizing another sail and we'll be back on the water because I'm going to take you bastard sailing. <laughs>